So hey everyone, John Brent here. We are in Hampton, New Hampshire. You can see the beach is right behind me, steps away. We are outside Flamingo's Coffee Bar. We're gonna get some amazing iced coffee on this cold February day because we're New Englanders and that's what we do. Come on in, let's go see Mackenzie and we'll get some coffee. So hey everyone, I'm John Byrne with Real Broker. Welcome to another episode of Eats in the 603. We are inside of Flamingo's Coffee Bar in Hampton, New Hampshire. I'm here with Mackenzie. Mackenzie's the owner of Flamingo's. Mackenzie, tell us a little bit about how you got started, what business is like, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for coming in today. It's nice to meet you all. Yeah. We're happy to have you. So we opened this past summer. Um, Memorial Day weekend was our launch date. We were just trying to bring a sort of elevated coffee experience to Hampton Beach. Um, we have a full espresso bar, full coffee bar. We wanted to sort of bring a fun, uh, vibrant vibe here. Um, it's the fun wallpaper and the name Flamingo. So we just wanted to bring a place um, to the beach where you can kind of be transported to kind of like a Florida or West Coast feel and have some great um, coffee and food selections too. It's funny that you said Florida because now I'm feeling it. Yes. <laughs> it's pink and it's fun and you have a cool menu. So. Yes. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about kind of what makes you unique. Sure. So we have some awesome specialty lattes that we do. Um, our baristas are really talented. They're always creating new fun flavors and we're always rotating them. Um, so they're kind of flavors you can't really get anywhere else. Yeah. Um, we also uh, sample those flavors on our coffee flight. So our coffee flight's made of four specialty lattes. Um, they're, they come iced with oat milk and all these whipped cream toppings that we do. And they've been a huge hit. It's yeah. fun to sort of sample everything that we have. Um, and then we try to rotate those flavors every month or so so you can come back, try other flavors, yeah. um, try to keep up with the seasonality of it too. So fall, winter, spring flavors, rotating in and out. Um, that's been a huge hit. And yeah, so it's been fun. We also try to use as many local vendors as possible. Um, we like to say we kind of get the best of the seacoast in one spot. You can yeah. come and try everything um, from like our bagels to our coffee beans to our donuts and baked goods and bread. Um, we use local vendors for all of that. So we try to support other local businesses too. Um, our motto on the window here is support, support your local caffeine dealer. So we try to support other local businesses too. <laughs> So I found you guys on Facebook and Instagram, actually, through ads. Mm -hmm. And I had never seen a coffee flight in my life, and I thought it was so cool. Yeah. Um, but you were telling us a little bit about how you just became really famous recently. So <laughs> tell me know, that. I don't know if famous is the right word, but <laughs> um, we recently went viral on TikTok. So that was something we'd never uh, experienced before. So it was really cool. Um, we had over 100,000 views. and thousands of comments and thousands of shares um, and then that weekend was very wild. <laughs> um, it was really fun. People came from all over. We had people coming from Connecticut saying they drove three hours to get here. Um, so it's been fun. Then we started to get um, a lot of attention from that. It's kind of taken off since then but now we have a TikTok. <laughs> nice. All right so tell me a little bit about what I'm trying today. Yeah sure. Um, so you're gonna be having our latte flight. Um, it's called the Winter Flight Part 2, <laughs> and it's going to be the Mint Chocolate Chip, Almond Joy, Salted Caramel Creme Brulee, and Raspberry Mocha Lattes. Um, four of my favorites, so I'm really excited. I'm very excited for that <laughs> Creme Brulee one. Yeah, that's a, definitely a fan favorite. Um, and then for food, you're going to be having our Loaded Mingo Sandwich um, on a Jalapeno Cheddar Bagel. Ooh. Bagel is from Best Bagel out of Seabrook. Um, you're going to have ham, bacon and sausage on there, all boar's head meats, some um, jalapeno cheddar cheese, and a lettuce and um, spicy mayo top off. Very cool. I'm very yeah. excited for this. Me too. Thank you. You're so welcome. <laughs> 
Every time I sit down with food in front of me, I'm overwhelmed and I'm overwhelmed again because I have a sandwich, I have coffee, I have donuts. I love donuts. Um, but let's start with the sandwich. So savory, sweet. So this is the loaded mango, bacon, sausage, eggs, spicy mayo, lettuce, chipotle, cheddar, bagel. Mm -hmm. It's got sweet, salty, got a little spice from the bagel and the chipotle mayo that's on it, and the cheese. They actually got a lot of beef. It's really good. Got a nice little bite with the lettuce. Outstanding. There's four coffees. I'm not gonna try them all for this. I'm just gonna go for the one I'm most excited about. It's a slippery little sucker. It's the salted caramel creme brulee. Mm. Sorry, mom. Um, Sweet. You actually taste the coffee still, even though you have the sweetness from the salt caramel out of this world. Donuts. I have a Reese's donut. I have a... And I have a Fruity Pebble donut. I lost track of myself there for a second. I'm gonna go for the Fruity Pebble. Mm -mm. That's so good. Listen, if you're in Hampton, New Hampshire, and you want to go to the beach, and you need a really cool cup of coffee, or a delicious, delicious sandwich, or a donut, come to Flamingos, tell them Meats in the Sick 03 sent you, and I'll see you next time.